Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to another vlog. It Well, actually, it's afternoon. It's 1219, but it's like pitch black outside because I don't know if you can hear it, but it is pouring outside. It is coming down. And today is a very exciting day because I am having a rainy Disney day with Sierra and Grace. I'm so excited. I'm just getting ready to help Drew take Layla outside right now because she needs to wear her raincoat. And I figured you all need to see that because it's the cutest thing ever. I don't know if I showed it in the vlog. I feel like I did. I definitely posted a TikTok about it, but just gonna double team it. Um, it's a two man job because we have to hold our umbrellas. We have to hold her. Someone has to hold the poop, all of that. So anyways, enjoy this clip of Layla in her rain jacket. It's the cutest. Good girl, so beautiful. <laughs> Oh, sweet girl. Oh boy, she's so mad. I don't got no wellies. I don't got no wellies, you're right. All right, got my bag packed. It's in the car, ready to go. I don't even know if this camera is dirty. Yes, it is. So this is my outfit of the day. I really want to go into the parks and see if they have those beanies that have the Mickey ears on it, because I think that would be so cute. So we'll see about that. But in the meantime, I just have this beanie that's like, I don't even know where this is from. I actually just opened this sweatshirt. I came in a package from Hollister with a couple other things. Decided to wear this. Got my Lululemon leggings on which are very convenient because I have my phone and my keys in there right now. And then I have some like nice thick socks because it is kind of chilly. And then these boots were the best thing I could come up with. I have no rain appropriate clothes. So I'm gonna have an umbrella and then I think I'm gonna buy a poncho when I get there. I also brought a denim jacket in case it gets really cold, but that's my outfit of the day. Layla's all set and ready to go. Moo is always set and ready to go. I've got my snack in the car, got my water, got my portable phone charger, got chapstick money driver's license, everything I think I need. So let's head off to Disney and have a fun little rainy Disney day. I feel like this will be a fun memory to have and look back on and be like, that was fun. We don't know how long we're gonna last, we'll see. We've basically come to the agreement that like, we'll just go as long as it's fun, <laughs> as long as we're enjoying ourselves. We almost got rained out this morning. I actually canceled like a couple days ago. I was like, no, I don't think I'm gonna go. It's gonna be too rainy. And then this morning I was like, let's just do it. Like, let's just have fun. So that's what we're doing. So let's head off to Disneyland and have a fun rainy Disney day. I'm already getting so wet. I need to locate a poncho immediately. <laughs> into California Adventure to meet Sierra. I'm already getting soaked. I need better clothing for sure. A lot of other people have like raincoats, umbrellas. I might as well get my umbrella out. We're gonna get through this together. It's just a little rain. It actually kind of makes it feel more magical. I'm excited. Here we have it. It's called Fashion Sweetie. Look it up. Checking in, it's been a little while. I am already soaked. Like this part of my jacket is so wet. But we're having so much fun. We're having such a fun wholesome girls day. I haven't had a chance to vlog because my camera is deep in my backpack hidden. It is so, so wet. Hope you enjoy a little bit of a montage. I just really wanna be present and hang out with the girls. But I'm happy I came. It's wet, but we're having a freaking great time. And we just finished up at California Adventure. We've been here like probably two, three hours. And now we're gonna head over to Disneyland. Let's do it. Back to the phone, because I am ruining this camera. It's 
Yeah. <laughs> One more. Much fun with Miss Carrie. Yeah. <laughs> Are we splashing in the puddles together? Yeah. Let's go walk through the castle. Right there. Should we do that? <laughs> recently opened and every time we've been since it opened we haven't been able to get on it so us gals are going on it and I'm excited it's my first time Toontown is like my childhood so it makes me really happy almost 7 p.m. So I've actually only been here for like about five hours, but I'm getting cold and soaking wet and my feet are starting to hurt. So it's just time to call it. I think Sierra and Grace are gonna stay for another couple rides and then they're gonna head back as well. And I'm just getting a head start. So it's been a wonderful, fun, wet, cold Disney day, but we've had a freaking blast. I'm so glad I came. I miss Disney. I don't think I've been here in like, I don't know, a month. So it was good to be back and we'll be back soon. couldn't be happier to take this wet denim jacket off. And actually on the way out, I found a rain jacket. I like ended up walking through a store just to like avoid walking through the rain. And I happened to see this cute rain jacket and it has mini with some balloons on it. And I mean, it's a legit rain jacket. Like there's no liner. It is solely for rain. I got it in a 2X, so it would be like a little bit oversized. There's a hood. There's also like some strings to like tighten it around your face. And it retailed for $54.99, which like pretty expensive. But then with my magic key, like my annual pass discount, I got it for like $47 with tax. And I think that's a pretty good deal. And I can wear that like if I go on hikes, I can wear it if it ever rains like in LA, I can wear it to Disneyland. So it'll be multi-use. And Drew has a rain jacket that I was gonna wear today, but it didn't have a hood. And I really wanted one with a hood. And like the poncho was great, but this much of my arms were sticking out on either side. So I was just getting soaked. But I kept the denim jacket on because then it was protecting this layer from getting wet. It's like damp, but it's not bad. So anyway, I am going to, let's see how long it's gonna take to get home. 50 minutes, not bad at all. It took almost two hours to get here because of traffic and just rain and all that good stuff. But I had such a good day with Sierra and Grace. I love those girls. I love Sierra. I'm so lucky to have a friend like her. I love living in LA where I can just like pop over to Disneyland for five hours and then drive home. So anyways, okay, gonna head home and we will check in later. But ah, oh, such a good Disney day. So glad I went. I'm putting the rain jacket to the test. It's much later. It's like 10.30 now. We watched Love Island. We sat on the couch, ate dinner. And um, the rain jacket is being put to use. Here is... <laughs> I literally was like, I need to show what it looks like taking the dog out right now because this is my outfit. This wasn't me trying to be funny and be like, oh, let me put on like a funky. <laughs> it's literally my Ugg slippers because they're platformed. My pants tucked in my socks because I don't want them to get wet. These are the pants I'm going to sleep in. My sleep shirt. It's like a vintage Disney shirt. I have this thing because I'm cold and then my rain jacket. This is my outfit. Good morning, everybody. It's a couple days later. It's actually Monday morning now, and it is 7.15 a.m., and I thought I would take you along on a little work day in my life. I've got, like, a actually pretty light work day today, which I feel like is why I'm able to even film something like this, but in case you were ever interested in what, like, my day-to-day -day looks like or when I'm like, oh, I've been doing computer work all day or whatever, I thought I would show you what some of that entails. So I'm gonna get started on that in a minute. We had a great weekend. Got home from Disney Friday night, showed you all of that. Saturday, it actually hailed in LA. 
so that was really exciting and cool and then we just kind of chilled we laid around we lounged saturday was a very loungy day and then yesterday we went thrifting drew and i have been looking for some stuff so i actually filmed a main channel video for that which you'll see soon and we have a pet sitter that's staying here while we're in japan and we've been practicing with them and just sort of like getting them used to layla and her routine and all that good stuff so that was what we did yesterday and now here we are monday morning so first things first i am going into my email to grab a file for captions um i have all of my videos captioned so main channel videos vlogs and i use a company called rev and they're hit or miss sometimes it's really good it's actually been better lately and then sometimes it's like really bad but you can send your videos off to be captioned um and you pay i think like a dollar fifty a minute maybe and then you add them to your video. So I'm going into like the settings of a new vlog that is actually gonna go up today. So I'm cutting it a little close with that one. I have to sneeze. No, I don't, just kidding. So I'm going into the settings for this vlog and then I'm going to add the file. So I just downloaded it from my email, I think. Did I? Yes. So basically here is the vlog. So I'm gonna go in here to subtitles and then I'm gonna upload the file. And there it is and then I'm just like gonna double check and see that they're all good and then I hit done and then I schedule the vlog to go up so we're gonna switch it from unlisted to scheduled that is going up today at 10 a.m. 10 a.m. there we go and it should be good so we'll save that now for main channel stuff I actually have somebody who helps me a part of the time to do like rough cuts of my videos and editor her name's Fallon if you're watching this hi Fallon I keep all of my to-do list on um, notes app in my phone so I just kind of like check there throughout the day I know there's probably better like list options I'm gonna go through my emails in a minute but I need to go to Dropbox and create a new transfer because because I'm actually sending over the footage that I filmed yesterday for the thrift with me. So I'm going to put my little memory card into my computer and then I transfer that to my hard drive because everyone knows laptops don't really have that much storage. So I'm gonna import this footage. I typically import footage like, I don't know, a couple times a week I would say because you know, I'm always <laughs> vlogging, I'm always filming. So here is what I do. I basically create a new folder, which this one is a thrifting video. And then I will go into the memory card and pull the files. Oh, this is from the haul. So these will go. And then the rest of the footage is actually on another memory card. So after that's done importing, which you can see here, this isn't a very good angle. There we go. All right, that's done. Then I will eject this memory card and add the other. So I'll put in the new one here and import this one too. Some of this goes into like a vlog folder and then the rest of this is the thrifting video. So I just select all of these, add them to my folder. That's a lot of files. <laughs> then I go to Dropbox and I send her the files through there. So you just like create a new transfer, you put in all the footage and then I use like any notes that I may have for her. I'll type up an email just being like, here's the format of the video. Feel free to cut out this, this and that or whatever. Just give her like a general outline and then she'll send me the project file of just basically like the rough cut of the videos. And then I will go in because I'm a control freak. I will go in and add like the bells and whistles. I'll maybe like take some things out that I'm not comfortable with or whatever. And then I'll upload it and then go from there so that's the next thing we're gonna do we're gonna take one more second to review this footage and then send over that footage to her for her to edit all right while i'm waiting for that to take forever to upload i'm actually going to import or put some other files into final cut pro that i'm working on for a main channel video so that video is a fitting room video that i i think i a couple vlogs ago showed you when i was filming that so i need to import that get an edit done on that i have to do a voiceover for that one for the fitting room because i do not talk in those fitting rooms anymore absolutely not so i'm going to import that into my editing program while the other footage is being sent off does that make sense i'm just trying to mold I task you know what I mean I have a meeting at 9 a.m. so I have about an hour and a half now to get as much of this done and then I'm meeting with my tax accountant who is gonna help me finish up my taxes and do some other stuff like regarding my business and everything so in the meantime let's get editing maybe have a little coffee break and then hop on a meeting in about an hour or so let's do it Monday oh Monday <laughs> We're taking a little coffee break and I forgot to mention that um, I have like a hair treatment, like an Olaplex and 
scalp oil in my hair right now. So that's why it's slicked to the gods. I actually took out my extensions this morning. I took out my tapins myself. Don't yell at me. I already did it, okay? So anyways, it was fine. It wasn't a big deal. But then anyways, we made some croissants from Trader Joe's and I was like, oh, I could eat one of those. But then I remembered that we went to this place called Mochi Nut yesterday. These are mochi donuts and we tried some of these when we went to Hawaii in like 2019, beginning of 2019, I think. And they were so good. They put like mochi in the dough and it just makes it like really chewy. And so we got four different flavors and I'm so excited. We're gonna try them all. So they don't all fit in the box perfectly, but this one is pistachio flavored. This one is lotus or Biscoff flavored. This one's fruity pebbles and milk. And then this one's Thai tea and they look so freaking good. So we're gonna try them. I've also been obsessed with making brown sugar oat milk shaken espressos, except we do stirred, don't we? It's yeah. gonna really shake it, because like, who cares? It's so freaking good, love it. Okay, Drew's here too. Uh, I'm already my hair too much. <laughs> it's okay, it cuts off actually, you can't see it, look. Well, now you can. <laughs> Should we try pistachios since it's like right here? Sure. They are greasy. They're very greasy. But also, you got to this today. Yeah, true. Mm. I don't taste any pistachio. Oh, neither do I. It just tastes like vanilla. You know what the dough kind of tastes like? Like a funnel cake. Mm, it's a funnel chewy. cake was chewy. That's what it would taste like. It's really good. Probably because of all the oil. Mm -hmm. well, I, seriously, look at this oil. Which one do you want to try next? Fruity pebble. Fruity pebs. It's the morning. Cereal. Cheers. So it's going to be chewy. I think it would hit more if they were fresh. fresh. Pretty greasy. The dough is really good. What's next? Thai tea? You lotus. Lotus? You even get a Biscoff cookie, but it's like... <laughs> There's no snap. You're supposed to eat the cookie with it? Probably. I mean, yeah. I only taste the Biscoff because of the cookie. Mm -hmm. But it is delicious. And then the last one is Thai tea. With sprinkles. With sprinkles. Here you go. Cheers. Cheers. That one tastes like Thai tea. Mm -hmm. It's good. Thai tea is so good. Mm. If you had to rank them, what would you choose? Thai tea first. Okay. Biscoff, fruity pebble, pistachio. Mm. Mine are different. Mine's Biscoff, Thai tea, pistachio, fruity pebble. Delish. Tasty. All right. That's it. Back to the work day we go. Bye now. Bye now. Go to work. <laughs> All right, now it is time for my call. It's 8.58, my call starts at nine. These headphones are dead, okay. We'll just go with the regular headphones. And I did some laundry in the meantime. I'm hanging some of the stuff that I thrifted and washed yesterday. So don't mind that mess behind me, in fact. Let's just move that out of the way of the call. <laughs> Has anyone else, you know, over the last three years almost of doing Zoom calls, just like absolutely loathe Zoom at this point? <laughs> it's like my least favorite thing in the entire world. But anyways, such is life. So let's do it. Morning. Good. How are you? All right, it is now 9.34 and I actually just randomly filmed a TikTok um, based off of an experience that happened to me this morning that was very bizarre. I wasn't even sure if I was gonna like mention it in a vlog because it's not that big of a deal, but it's just sort of one of those things where it's like, yep, this is uh, what it's like to be a woman. I was walking Layla and there's a man that I see sometimes in my neighborhood, um, but like we're not, we don't know each other, you know, nothing like that. And um, he was driving down my street and he rolled down his window and was trying to say something to me, literally stopped his car in the street and was trying to say something to me. And then the car behind him started honking. So he like was like, hold on. So he pulled around, got out of his car, walked up to me and was like, I just wanted to let you know that um, I'm a very health conscious person and you look smaller than the last time I saw you. And I was just like, Okay, like I did not know what to say. But anyways, I made a TikTok about it. If you wanna follow me on TikTok, it's down below, but it was, I just made like a funny TikTok about it because it was just like, thanks. Imagine him doing that to another man. So I did that, filmed a little TikTok, forgot to 
mention that. I'm going to answer some emails. I'm actually behind on some of my work emails. Sometimes I get offered like brand deals in my email. Like for example, I got offered one just now and I'm not gonna be able to do it just because of like timeline stuff. I'll be out of town when it's due. I've already gotten like way overbooked in the time that I have between now and when we leave for Japan. So I'm gonna probably reply to that and be like, no. And then there's a couple other ones I need to reply to. And then pretty much, honestly, like I thought I was gonna be filming more, but literally I'm just gonna be editing for the rest of the day. I'm gonna edit that main channel like I mentioned before that I already started on. I'm gonna complete that. I'm gonna do the voiceover for that, all that good stuff, make the thumbnail, upload it, add links, fill out the description box, all that kind of stuff. And then after that, I'm actually gonna edit this vlog. So this vlog is gonna be ready to go. So what you're watching now, I will finish. And then I'll probably be done with the work day around 4.30ish. That's typically my work day is like 7, 7.30 to like 4, 4.30. And then I try to shut off for the night. So actually, I think I'm just gonna end the vlog here. I Maybe I'll do like a more detailed day in my life, but I feel like it's just really boring to watch because today is very much like an admin day. Like there's no film. It's literally just like editing, sending off more footage to be edited, more editing, emails, business calls, you know, all that kind of stuff. So anyway, hope you enjoyed this vlog. Thanks for hanging out with me and I'll see you very soon in the next one. Bye.